have the ability to organize your assessments in three different ways. One of those options is considered a premium option called Playlist, and we will link more information about that in the description below. Today, we're only going to focus on the two free options. The first option is to go to the Assignments tab. From the Assignments tab, you have the ability to add a new folder. You can choose New Folder and add in any title you want here. I'll go ahead and call this one DCA English, so I can add in my DCA English assessments. Now to add the assessment to the folder, is just click on the box to the left and then move to the DCA English folder. Now that the assessment has successfully been moved into the folder, I'll go ahead and click on that folder to see that assessment. I can go back to all assignments at any time to see the rest of my assignments I have assigned. The second option is the test library option. From here, you can either choose to edit a draft assessment or go to new test and start from scratch. The most important feature here is when you're in description, you change the tag. The tag is how you'll filter your assessments later on. If I were to add the tag DCA, I could filter that in the test library by going to authored by me, scrolling down to the bottom and choosing tags, typing in DCA. Now it'll show me all of my DCA assessments. If you plan on making several district common assessments, you might consider adding more to that tag like DCA fifth grade math. So that way it is easier to find. 